question 30. RAM. What does it stand for? Random access memory. Hmm? I'm sorry? You asked a question. The answer is random access memory. Right. Right. I'm sorry, guys. I'm uh, more than a little distracted today. Can't believe I'm uh, actually getting married tomorrow. OK, well, uh, that's it. Any final questions? Yes. When are you going to open this? Guys. Speech, 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 OK, OK, uh, where to start? Uh, love, exciting and new. Do we really have to I'm hear this? I'm hoping that uh, sooner or later you'll all find that love and recognize that love. And I'm about to throw up. That Somebody's Ruby never been in love. love. And you have, Sean? Only two really? Can With two? Exactly. Not Emma by any truly... chance. Wow. Thanks. And remember, breathe. I had to get something for my head. You don't have a cold. No, no, just a headache. OK. OK, I'm trying not to panic, just being realistic. We have a lot to do today before tomorrow. And um, let me just go upstairs and take this first. No. Take it in the car. I'll just run in and out, OK? Then we'll hit the engraver's cicaders and home before Caitlin arrives to perm my hair. And don't forget to take your headache stuff. I'll be back before you know it. been like pointless it doesn't mean it's not real is she real hey i thought you were off today emma i am i have to turn this into kwan miss kwan one essay one attendance slip if only all students were as hardworking as you emma so um remember a certain someone you dated last year sean seems he's still in love with you sean in love with me no, Sean and I dated. We weren't in love. Not what he says. So you have to invite him to the wedding. No, I don't. Sean and I are over, no matter what you heard. Did you hear? Doesn't matter, right? It's over. Right. And I'm late, so butt out. You're still coming over tonight, though, right? Yeah, I guess. OK, bye. Put on your shoes. Hey, Sean. Hey, Manny. So, tomorrow, big wedding. Yeah, I give my best to Miss Nelson. Actually, you can tell her. Emma came by earlier to get some books, and she said this was for you. Emma wants me at the wedding? Yeah, she made me promise I'd, like, get this to you. Cool. Thanks. Thanks, Manny.
JT, math class is that way. Yeah, I know, but we have a very important pit stop to make. Okay. I've been thinking. There are some upsides to love. Emma got the day off. Yeah. Simpson canceled homework. True. And strippers. Because when I think of love, I always think of strippers. Marriage equals stag party equals strippers, which equals tonight. A stripper tonight? Just keep that cool. Craig, man. JP and uh, Tony, what's up? Yeah, it's actually JT and Toby. Um, so we heard that your stepdad is hosting a little get together tonight, huh? Yeah, uh, stag. Right. We were just hoping that maybe we could uh, drop by and maybe wish Mr. Simpson good luck. And if there's a stripper there, we'd love to give her our best. <laughs> No strippers, guys. Simpson told Joey not to get one. What? I... It's like, it's like a rite of passage. It's Simpson's last night of freedom. He can't not have a stripper. I know, I know. It's lame. It's unforgivably lame. So, Craig, you want to do something about it? Let me do the talking, boys. And tonight, it's showtime. She's the one, Craig. She has got to be the one. Down, boy. Yeah, Tobes, gross. But we can get her, right? Always goes through down the road. Uh, we're actually here to inquire about Miss Fanny. Fancy. Fancy? If she's available tonight. Yes, for an outside engagement. <laughs> Fancy, don't do no square dance. Come back when you're legal. Wait, no. This is gonna take some very delicate negotiating. Which is why you two are staying here. Hey, Joey. Craig, did you get everything I need for tonight? Almost everything. It's like this. I'm at the store, faced with a choice. Excuse me. Yeah, now do I get, listen, do I get plain boring chips or hot and spicy nachos? So what do you think I got? I don't know, ice cream. I got hot and spicy. Good. Like, say, tonight, plain boring stag event or hot and spicy stag party. <laughs> All it takes is one fancy stripper. <laughs> uh, no, no. Come on. It's a tradition, Joey. Yeah, I know it's a tradition. Yeah, so I... how about it? No, it goes against Snake's wishes, all right? It, it's sexist, it's um. Yeah, but. And it's perfect. You know what? I'm going to embarrass the heck out of him. Fine, but technically, this was your idea. I'm not getting in trouble for it. Angie! I'm going to Grimmauld! Yes, you are. Come on, baby. <laughs> okay, so you're sure it'll just be a body perm, right? Like this? And I do this for a living. Yes. Okay, 20 minutes. Are you okay if I go up and have a shower? Yes, just go and relax. Wedding cake. Okay. Just sign here, please. No, no, I go to cut for you. She okay. Thank you. Happy bat mitz for Rhoda. Mom, major emergency. This cake isn't yours, unless you change your name to Rhoda. Just send it back, no big deal. No big deal. This is your wedding cake. There's way more important stuff going on, Em. Way more important. Yeah, like what? The test is positive. I'm, I'm pregnant. Em. 
wrong? What's wrong? My mom is pregnant. Wow. How did it happen? I mean, I know how it happened, but did they plan it? No. At least I don't think so. Well, it's kind of exciting. On some level. How about some good news? Please, anything. Guess who's coming tomorrow? Sean Cameron, your love. I'm not smiling. Manny, I told you no, Sean. I was trying to help. By playing matchmaker, go help and uninvite him. <sighs> okay, but what's that smell? My mom! Mom! My hair! Your hair! <gasps> My hair! Honey, it'll be okay, I promise. When? Well, when? After the wedding. I can't put any more chemicals in your hair right now. It'll fall out. I'll get that. I'm gonna be your maid of honor, looking like this. It'll be okay. Hey, how are you? Hi. Good to see you. Hi. I miss you. So, what do you think? Good enough for your wedding party? I love them. I just told you guys, wear whatever you want. We are. It just so happens we both love the same dress. Yeah, we wanted to do it. Come on. Guys, it's just a wedding. Yeah, your wedding to Snake, <laughs> to Archie. <laughs> <laughs> How are you? And what happened? Somebody left my perm solution in too long. Spike, you didn't. I thought you're supposed to be a professional. I am, but getting married is huge. Well, that's why we're here to help. That's right. And to take your mind off things, we're throwing a little girls' night out later. Because if Snake can go out tonight, so can you. That's right. <laughs> That's great. You guys are so great. Give me a give me a hug. <laughs> Doing some good work, huh? Huh? Yeah, here, use this. So I thought maybe we'd uh, get out of the city tomorrow. Go up to the space side back roads up near Acton. Nelson as in Emma Nelson? Yeah. <laughs> Looks like you got some better plans. Shot! Are you OK? Annie, you okay? Fine. Something wrong? Yeah, sort of. What? God, God, I'm kidding. You remember that invite I gave you? Yeah. Right here. <laughs> Sort of a mistake. Sean, I'm really sorry. It's just. Don't, don't worry about it. Sorry. No, no, don't worry. It's, it's no problem. still stands if you want. Yeah. We're back. Hey. Hey. How are you doing? I'm good. good Congratulations. You. Thank you. Hi. How are you? Good. Hi. You look good. Thanks. Good to see you again. Likewise. Um, what is all this stuff? Uh, it's mine. You know, my lease is up at the end of the week, so I'm moving in bit by bit. Don't you have enough to worry about right now? Stay worried? Come on. Oh, that's funny, Jeremiah. Between the wedding and moving in, I'm like a heart attack in motion. Believe it. Oh, oh no. Does it bite? <laughs> wedding gift from my class. 
It's very, um... Very ugly, I know. Sorry. Um, so guys, what do you got planned for tonight? Doing the typical guy stuff? Scotch, cigars, strippers? Uh, I told Joey no strippers, right? Nope, nope. We're going bowling. Snake, come here, talk to me. Yes, master. Sounds serious. No, no, just sweating stuff. Hey, guys. Hey, Luz. Can you believe this wedding? So, when are you guys gonna have a little mini spike or mini snake to add to mini Caitlin over there? <laughs> oh, well, we've discussed it. We, uh, Definitely want kids. Definitely, and and who knows? It could happen sooner than you think. Well, I sure hope not. <laughs> Just like a man that wants to rush into anything. We got a lot on our plates right now. You know, I've got to settle in, get used to being a husband and a stepdad. Right. Oh, I'm not saying never, just not right now. Hey, you wanted to talk wedding? No, I figured it out. Thanks. The cigars are over there, all right? Sir, till 2 a.m. Perfect. Have a good time. Thank you. All right. Stay. What's going on, man? Loosen up. It's your stay. I'm trying. I'm right, trying. Here you go. Okay. We got something planned for later. Just want to cheer you up, okay? Yeah. I'll get it. All right. <laughs> Guys, what's the problem? Well, I haven't cleared you with Joey yet. Look, guys, whatever you're selling, we're not interested in, okay? What are you selling anyways? Actually, we're, uh, we're here for the show. Yeah. Fancy was sort of their idea. Well, really? Oh, in that case, no. But come on. No, get out of here. Both of your ages combined would not make you old enough. But how come Craig gets to stay and watch the show? Craig gets to go upstairs in his bedroom and watch TV, okay? But Joey... No! No! No, Nick! No! Look, Craig, we're in the same boat as you, so, you know, it's... bachelorette party. I just can't, okay? You know, that kind of sounds to me like you're pregnant, Spike. <laughs> okay. You're pregnant. It's nothing to be ashamed of. Yeah, I mean, totally. Look, at least this time you've got someone who loves you. Yeah, someone who's gonna be there for you. A guy you. who doesn't want kids. You guys heard him? Yeah. He made where he stands very clear. He doesn't want a kid right now. So what are you gonna do? I don't know. Cancel tomorrow? <laughs> I mean, I love Snake, but Emma and I have gotten this far on our own. Maybe, maybe this wasn't meant to happen. <laughs> Spike. I'm serious, Caitlin. What are you gonna do about the baby? That wasn't meant to happen either. So maybe it won't. So, Sean, you sure he wasn't too upset when you told him? For the millionth time, he wasn't upset. Good. I hope Snake will take his news just as well. My parents have, like, 20 siblings, so I say the more the merrier. Actually, I'd love to have a little brother. Or a sister. I'm not picky. I just... I want it to feel like a family, and a new baby would so do that. Hey, how was your last night as a single woman? Did you guys get all wild and crazy? It was fine. So can I take this off now? Sure. Here. How 
How's it look? I've ruined everything. Hey, Spike. I wouldn't. She's pretty upset. Still? Why don't you stay down here? We'll try and uh, iron it out. I'll just be one minute. OK, I know what you found out is beyond weird, but it's not the end of the world. I'm fine with this, and Snake will be too. We just have to convince him that. Convince him? How? I don't know. However you convinced me about you two. If I even have this baby. What? We don't want any more kids right now. End of story. End of story for who? You're not thinking of having an abortion. I might. <laughs>